Oh, hello. This is Tak Chong from Walk with Tak. And welcome to my YouTube channel. Uh, if you enjoyed this video, uh, please like, subscribe and share. Oh, welcome back. Uh, thank you for coming to see me again. Uh, hopefully, I can help you to make your home cooking more fun. Uh, when I was growing up, I eat a lot of noodle soups, uh, mostly for breakfast and sometimes for late night snacks. The warm noodle soups uh, brings back many good memories. And now uh, it is my comfort food. In here, I'm going to show you how to make a noodle soup in less than five minutes. Well, first of all, you got to have some noodles ready. So I usually make up a batch of uh, angel hair pasta noodles. As I have shown in other videos, the wok is perfect for boiling noodles. The wok is large enough to accommodate as much as two pounds of noodles. The large opening of the wok make it a perfect size to accommodate noodles that is 12 inch long. I store the noodles in plastic containers. Uh, they are usually good for about a week to 10 days. I use the noodles for different purposes. Uh, sometimes I use them for pan fry. Of course, I use the noodles for spaghetti as well. I learned how to prepare the noodle for the noodle soup uh, when I was in Vietnam. What they do is that they would take cold noodles that already cooked and they would rinse it in hot water. It only takes just a few seconds, but it gets the noodle to the right temperature. In Vietnam, they eat a type of rice noodles, they call it pho, and they eat that almost every meal. I love rice noodles as well, but I could not get them easily uh, here. So I did some uh, research and with some experimentation, I find that the angel hair noodle actually makes a wonderful substitution. So what I did is that I put the noodles in a spider web strainer. I then pour hot water over the noodle, uh, enough water so that the noodle would be submerged in hot water. Uh, like they did in the Vietnamese uh, noodle restaurant, uh, the noodle only need to be in the hot water for a few seconds. Uh, just enough to take the chill uh, out of the uh, noodles when they come out from the refrigerator. Uh, I then pour off the water in the bowl and return the noodles back to the bowl. And next, I'm going to create a soup for the noodle by adding some of my basic seasoning mix. And this is followed by adding a few drops of uh, sesame oil. Uh, I also add a little bit of uh, soy sauce to make the soup a little bit more saltier. And you can add a little bit more or less soy sauce depends on how you like the flavor of the noodle soup. And this is where prepping up in advance has become really handy. Uh, I found some scallions in the refrigerator, which I use it to garnish the noodle. Uh, I then add some uh, peanut to the noodle. I love peanuts. Uh, quite often, if I have some cashew, uh, this is the nut of choice for me. And next, I found some white button mushroom in the refrigerator that already cut up in my advanced prepping. Again, depend on the mushroom I have. Sometimes I add portobello mushroom instead. And next, I found some ch cherry tomatoes, and they are an excellent addition to the noodle soup. Uh, last but not least, I found some colored bell pepper. I just had a few uh, to enhance the flavor and texture of the noodle soup. Okay, now I have finished assemble my noodle soup with different kinds of vegetables. And this is a good example that I am make good use of what I have in my advanced prepping. So as you can see, advanced prepping is not only useful for doing stir fry, but it's also useful for cooking other type of dishes. And my friend Tracy actually told me that uh, she find advanced prepping is very useful uh, for her to make up a regular salad as well. Okay, I'm ready to uh, add hot boiling hot water uh, to the bowl. And make sure you have the water really hot. And then you cover the bowl for about two or three minutes. That will soften the texture of the vegetable that you add to the bowl. A few quick mix um, to mix up the seasonings as well as the vegetables. Now your noodle soup is ready. I love this noodle soup. And you know, it takes just a few minutes and it takes probably less than 50 cents to create this amazing noodle soup. So what is the verdict? Well, first of all, I really like the angel hair pasta. I was surprised how well the angel hair pasta uh, performed in a noodle soup like this. And secondly, the flavor of the soup is excellent using my basic seasoning mix with a touch of sesame oil and some soy sauce. 
Actually, my friend Don uh, eat this noodle soup often for breakfast, and he getting pretty creative. A lot of time, he would cook extra for dinner and use the leftover to go over the soup. As you can see, the possibility is almost infinite、uh, based on your creativity and your imagination. If you come up with some clever ideas、uh, how to、uh, make this soup,、uh, please let me know. I love to hear from you. Thank you for watching.、Uh, if you enjoyed this video,、uh, please click like, subscribe, and share. I'll see you next time.